part of the Underground Grand Prix 2014. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, making his tough enough debut tonight, fighting out of Team Concrete, Livermore, California. Concrete, Cameron. The opponent stands across the cage in the right corner, also making his tough enough debut tonight, fighting out of Team Quest, San Diego, California. Ryan O'Hagan! Yeah, Referee in charge of the action inside the cage is Dr. John Quinn. Cameron Olsen's mouthpiece looks like it's getting ready to fall out. That would be bad. Just about 45 seconds left here in this opening round. Nice quick knee to the body there from O'Hagan. I mean, both of these guys certainly don't lack confidence. I like it. A lot of speed at the 130 or in the 135 pound division. Nice outside leg kick there from O'Hagan. Both of them pushing forward, being aggressive. Question is who's going to land that big shot first? Looks like Olsen ate one there. Final 10 seconds here of this opening round. They are mixing it up and mixing it up hard. Both fighters very aggressive with each other saying, come on. Olsen's walking in, grabs a kick, tries to land some punches, goes for the takedown, but I don't think that one's gonna count. Very close first round. Technically speaking, certainly a nod going to Ryan O'Hagan, who's wearing the white and the blue trunks tonight, but when it comes to heart, concrete Cameron Olsen certainly not lacking in that department. Or attitude. Showing, lots, lots of attitude. Showing a lot of attitude here inside the uh, the Tough Enough cage. I like it, man. I, I, I like I like the confidence being showed by both these fighters for the first time in here. Yeah, we got internet bragging rights on the line, Dave. Here, looking at a little bit of the replay, you see Cameron Olsen kind of baiting in. He grabs that foot as he comes in. This is the end of the round. So that takedown, even though it happened, I don't think it counted. I think that actually came before the bell. Look at uh, look at Cameron Olsen sitting over there, though, right? Just, just relax. Just chilling. It's, it's hard to call. I mean, if you, if you had to make a call on that round, what, what would you say? I, I would say that the... Um, the round went to Ryan O'Hagan. And that, again, that's unofficial, that's on our scorecards. But the reason why I say the Ryan O'Hagan won the round is because he just landed more shots. I can see it was a very close round. Cameron Olsen, I mean, that takedown in the end, some judges may have counted it. May or may not have. Here we go, round number two. Concrete Cameron Olsen is wearing the black trunks. Ryan O'Hagan in the white and the blue. And again, Cameron Olsen is winding up that punch, even though that didn't exactly work for him in round number one. He's ready to go, loads up on that one, just misses, and he's winding it up once again. Leading forward with that chin. <laughs> ah, I love it, man. The Underground Grand Prix needs to happen on every single Tough Enough card. This is fantastic. The corner of Ryan O'Hagan is telling him to remain technical. Concrete Cameron Olsen not too interested in keeping things textbook, if you will. I don't know, unless there's a textbook where it says wind up your fist like that. About 80 seconds left here in this second round. We're about halfway through this oh, fight. Big yeah. takedown from Ryan O'Hagan. Beautifully done. Elevated, mm -hmm. double leg, puts concrete Cameron Olsen directly on his back and he's looking to pass here. He's got a knee on that belly. Can he get it over? He does. Yep. He's got a full minute to work here. 
Now, concrete Cameron Olsen has got his arm looped over the head of Ryan O'Hagan. What O'Hagan wants to do is try to posture up so he can rain down some punches, but he's got oh. oh. That is the end. O'Hagan was working a choke. We didn't even see it. Could not see it from this angle. It looked like he was trying to posture up, but O'Hagan was, in fact, looking for a submission. Very slick move for a debut as the amateur. From our commentator position, and they were right down on the ground in front of us, we couldn't see the arm that actually secured the choke, but very slick move. Had no idea he was even working that. Beautifully done. Ryan O'Hagan gets it done with technique in his debut as an amateur tonight here at Tough Enough. You see the takedown right there, and that's, that was the beginning of the end. You see, so you can see O'Hagan working his arm around, but... He puts his knee right here on his belly, so he's gonna work past that butterfly guard, if you will. And concrete Cameron also gets over minutes. and you see the arm yep, there. That there was the arm is. that we couldn't see on the other side. And sure enough, it was tight enough. And Dr. John Quinn doing an excellent job there, keeping an eye on things, making sure you knew exactly what was going on in that fight. Concrete Cameron Olsen taps out and Ryan O'Hagan going back to San Diego with a victory tonight. Awesome fight. Dude, what an awesome card, man. This has been so much fun. Fantastic. The Underground Grand Prix, like I said just a moment ago, should have it on every single Tough Enough card. These fights are a blast. And when do you know? Red Corner won again. Tell me, man, they're on a roll tonight. Is it because the red corner is directly in front of our commentating position? They're hearing what we're saying? Yeah, that's, that's what it is. We'll take credit for it. Why yeah, not? Yeah, yeah. Why not? Yeah. yeah, why not? All right, here okay. we go. Official decision here at Tough Enough. Ladies and gentlemen, after a minute 15 into the second round, your winner by tap out due to Von Flu choke, Ryan O'Hagan. Look at old Von Flu choke. Gets it done, Mahoney. We rarely see that even in the pros. Great job by Ryan O'Hagan. One more fight to go in this Underground Grand Prix, even though I wish it would never, ever, ever end. Sid Rival and the infamous Justin Karp, both making their debuts tonight. They're coming up next as they step into the cage in the lightweight division.